percentages are a good way of talking about something being less than one. So, for example, if, if you have, let's say, um, an, an elephant here, um, let, let, let's say an, an, an elephant here, if, um, if you're talking about 80% of an elephant, uh, well, 50% would be half of an elephant. So 80% of an elephant, it, it gives you an indication of how big something is, uh, which is less than the whole thing. So 80% is actually less than one whole thing, but it gives you an indication of how big, um, how, how big it is in comparison to the whole thing. So here you, you could have a, a, a mouse here. Okay. Um, you could still have 80% of the mouse. So in this case, 80% of the mouse is, is, is this, this part here. So percentages is, um, it's just a good way of us, uh, for us to communicate how, how, um, how small something is or how big something is in comparison to the whole thing. Okay. So for example, if, if say you've, um, you've got a, a loaf of bread. Okay. Like this. Um, if you say, oh, I'm going to eat, uh, 30% of the whole, uh, of the whole loaf of bread. So 30%, well, 50% will be here. 30% will be somewhere here. So, so it, it gives you, um, well, actually 30% probably around here. So it, it gives you, um, it gives you a, a way of communicating how, how, um, how big or how small it is in comparison to the whole thing. Okay. Another good way is to actually use fractions. So, so for example, um, let's say you, um, you, you, you let, let's say you've won a mini lottery, uh, 724 pounds. Well, if you look at a diagram like, like this, hang on. Um, Another good way is, is to use fractions rather than percentages. Um, and you, you see why later. Seven, two, four. Now, let's say you're going to give, um, uh, two, two sevens to charity. So you, you're going to give this much to charity. Well, what does that mean? Um, well, if, if, if you look at this, this, this is your, your whole amount. So what you do, you, you divide, you divide, the, um, your whole amount into seven parts. So hang on, let, let me just do this. Uh, let, let's just guess roughly. So seven parts. So uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yep, I've got seven parts there. Um, and then, and then, um, you, you, well, you, you're giving two, two, um, two sevens uh, to 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 charity. So this is one part, two parts. So basically, you're giving away this amount. This amount goes away. Okay, so um, if you want to know how much you're actually giving to charity, all you have to do is get get your whole amount, uh, divide it into seven parts. So seven, uh, hang on, seven two four, divide into seven parts, and then and then you 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 and then times two parts because you're giving two parts away. Okay, so you you can actually do this. Divide into uh, seven parts, uh, and then and then uh, times two. If, if you want to know this, okay, um, uh, okay, so, so, so get a calculator out, um, hang on, clear, so, uh, 724, uh, divided by, divided by 7, so, so you're splitting into 7 parts, 7 equal parts, okay, it would be whatever that is, so each, so each part represents that, that amount of money, 103 pounds, 43 pence. So now you're giving two parts. So let's times that by two equals this. Okay. So you're, you're actually giving away 206, a two, 206, uh, pounds and, and 80, 86 pence, 86 pence. So, so if, if you're giving two sevens away to charity, then this is the amount that goes to charity. So all you have to do is get your whole amount. Uh, split it into seven, well, whatever, seven, in this case, seven equal parts, and you're giving away two parts. So, um, so, so basically times by two. So basically it's this. Okay? Um, yeah, okay.